To learn how to post an image using Flutter and Firebase, first, create an interface that allows the user to take a photo with the camera or select one from the gallery. Display the selected image and a field for the user to provide a description. Next, learn how to store the photo in Firebase Storage and the photo URL and description in the Firestore database. To create the interface, open the main.dart file and add an image button and text. Clicking on the image button should allow the user to select or take a photo. Create a u and 8 list variable to store the image and a function for selecting the image. The function should return a show dialog with the parameters build context and builder. The builder should return a simple dialog with the title text select image. Call this function in the icon button on pressed event to display the dialog when the button is pressed. Then add children to the dialog. Next, add an image picker dependency in the pubspec.yaml file, and then run pubget. Import the image picker package into the main.dart file. Create a utils directory and a utils file inside it, and then create a pickimage function. This function should be used to pick the image from the past image source, which can be the camera or gallery. The function should have a process that returns the selected image as bytes. Import the utils file in main.dart. Create a simple dialog option in the simple dialog widget. When pressed, call our pick image function with the camera as the source. Assign the returned value to a file variable. Then run the app. The camera should be working in the Android emulator. Next, add another simple dialog option with the phone gallery as the source. Run the app and check if it is working. Unfortunately, it may not work on the iOS emulator, as it requires more configuration. The info.plist file in the iOS runner folder needs to have the permissions for photo, camera, and microphone usage added. Open this file and add the necessary key string pairs. To display the selected images, check whether the data is in the file variable. If there is image data, display that image. Otherwise, display an icon button. Create a column widget to display the image inside a container using the memory image widget. To save the description and image, add a description box and an elevated button inside a row widget. Declare a controller variable for the description text field and include it in the text field. Add Firebase Core, Cloud Firestore, and Firebase Storage dependencies in the pubspec.yaml file. Open the main.dart file and import the Firebase Core package. Initialize Firebase in void main. Create a post class and declare the variables, description, post ID, date published, and post URL. Create a constructor and a function that returns a map object of these values. This value is for saving. 
Enable Firestore database and storage in Firebase. Add the UUID dependency for generating random post IDs. Create a resource folder and add a Dart file named image store methods. Import Firebase storage and UUID packages. Create a class called image store methods. Create a Firebase storage instance. Then create a future function image to storage that returns a string. Create an ID for the post. Then create a reference. A reference is an object that represents a reference to a file or a directory in a cloud storage service such as Firebase storage. Use the storage variable.ref.child to specify the folder names for the post and post ID. Create a upload task object to upload the file to Firebase storage. A upload task is an object that represents a task for uploading a file to a cloud storage service, such as Firebase storage. When you upload a file to a cloud storage service, the upload operation is usually asynchronous and can take some time to complete. During the upload process, you can use a upload task object to monitor the upload's progress and cancel the upload if necessary. Then call the put file method on that reference to create a upload task. You can then monitor the upload progress using the upload task snapshot property, which provides information about the upload progress, such as the number of bytes transferred and the upload percentage. Here, we take the download URL from the snapshot and return that URL. Import the Cloud Firestore package and the post class. Then create an instance of Firestore. Create a future function upload post that returns a string. First, call the image to storage function to get the photo URL. Then create a post ID using UUID. Create an instance of the post class and pass all the data that we need to save, description, post ID, date published, and photo URL. Then save the data to the posts collection. Return success. Then open the utils file and create a function for displaying a snack bar. This is for displaying messages after the upload process is complete. Open the main.dart file. Import the image store methods dart file. Create a function called postimage. Declare a bool variable called isLoading. This is for displaying a linear indicator during the upload process. It is set to true at first. Then call the upload post function and pass the parameters, description text and image file. If the upload is complete, the loading variable is set to false, and we call the show snack bar function to display a completed message. Else, we display an error message. Call this function on the elevated buttons on press. Then run the app, take a photo, try to add a description, and encounter a render flex error. Wrap the widget with a single child scroll view widget to solve this. Then rerun the app. Select an image from the gallery, add a description, and post it. The posted message is displayed. Open Firebase and check if the data is there. The post folder is created with the post ID, and the new data is in the database. Add code to display a linear progress indicator during the upload process.
Then create a clear image function that clears the file variable after the upload is complete. Call this function in the success part. Then rerun the app. The progress is displayed, the image is posted, and the data is there. Thank you for watching.